Today we have Konami's newest product. It is the Yu-Gi-Oh! Speed Duel GX Duelist of Shadows. Guys, this box is actually incredible. But first I want to ask you guys to check out the channel, subscribe for more insane, if not godly videos, and give this a thumbs up. And speaking of those thumbs, guys, we're doing three giveaways today for three separate sealed Speed Duel GX Duels of the Shadows, guys. All that you have to do is make sure you're subscribed to the channel, make sure you give the video a thumbs up, and post in the comments below which of the Duelist decks are you most excited for out of here. As you guys see, we'll go through the box and open up some of these guys. But personally, I'm excited. I think her name's Camille. Uh, the, sh the vampire deck is in here, guys. I'm like, what? This is insane. So let's check out what's inside, guys. It's actually going to be pretty freaking awesome. You also get secret rare versions of certain cards inside. There's some incredible reprints in here as well. Konami, great job. A fantastic speed build, box, speed build box. And technically, guys, this is the same box, same size, same amount of product as the GX and the Battle City uh, versions. So it's just a smaller box, more consolidated. Konami, we like things being consolidated, especially as a shop. The Darkness Awakens, eight ready to play decks inside. Beautiful, beautiful. Got your duels there. Let's see what the back says here. So here's our different characters. There you go for the giveaway. Supreme King Jaden, Shadow Rider Night Shroud. I didn't know that guy had a red eyes deck. Shadow Rider Camellia, Shadow Rider Tanya, Shadow Rider Titan, Shadow Rider Amnail, Kage Maru, and Adrian Gecko. So eight different duelists. Five different Shadow Riders and a Supreme King Jade in there. So very exciting, guys. Let's see what it says here as well. Unleash the Sacred Beast with the Duels of the Shadows box. Okay, well, that's what we're going to call it. Okay, let's jump right in, guys. Got a little, look at that. Barely any packaging, just a box. Love it, love it, love it. Pop it open, boom. Secrets, boom. Decks. All right, guys. So I would like to review the secrets with you first. The decks are actually extraordinary. And I do want to go over those. Um, it gives you four different, look at that, little play things. Is that eight or four? Yeah, it's four. Little field zones there. Uh, I do want to actually look at that because Konami will usually give away or make some sort of Duelist of the Shadows playmat for you guys. And it will possibly look exactly like this. So one side is Supreme King Jaden and the other side is Evil Heroes. And the other side is... Um, that one guy with his Helios and the DDDs. So, very cool. All right, so you get four different packages here, but these, I believe, like, like I said, have two decks each. Should be seeing two decks each and then some extra cards. Check out our secrets first. You do have a lineup of secrets in here, guys. So I do have some extra packages just to show you some of the different cards inside. Every secret package you are guaranteed the beautiful um, Sacred Beast. That's pretty cool. And the Shadow Riders. See, I actually didn't watch GX too far in, so I believe we have some maybe Shadow Rider symbols there. All right, first one here, we got Uriah, Hammond, and Raviel. That's pretty good. And we have Ill Blood. Look at that, guys. Ill Blood has arrived as a Seeker. That's actually gorgeous. Konami, these reprints are fantastic. Thank you. We have Arm Dragon level 10 to add to the Speed Duel lineup. Not bad. Vampire Genesis comes in as a secret. And Elemental Hero Shining Flare Wingman. Man, that slabbed up in a braided slab. It looked fantastic. And Aqua Chorus makes its way. Dragon Monsters use the same name on the field. Those gain 500 attack and defense. Uh, video game card? Where are we at with this one? I think it's a video game card. All right, so those are the first ones there. I'm going to go through a couple more packages just to see. Um, there's Super Poly, Allure, Macro Cosmos. Some of the most played cards right now some board played in many decks so we're gonna get our guaranteed sacred beast Ooh, we got a cyber dragon dark fusion nice dd crow secret rare that's beautiful amazon is queen yes there's an amazon is neck in here and macro cosmos wow that is so valuable this deck is fantastic guys i'm telling you boxes on a bit of a different level compared to some of the others for sure all right we got some of the helios here is there 20 or 15 i can't even remember there's a good amount though guys definitely a good amount queen is back vampire hunter fog king secret rare that's pretty cool guys and golden homunculus another uh banished helios card there so 
I'm gonna go, let's go one more. Let's just see, let's see where we go from here. Let's go one more, see if we can get some super polys. I mentioned a lure. Pog King is back. Malicious Fiend. Looks like these are actually dished out. Double, another Amazonist Queen there, Macrocosmos. The only one different in here was the Malicious Fiend there. At least see an allure. Ale Blood, beautiful. Amazonist Swordswoman, secret rare. Skull Arch Fiend of Lightning, look at that. And Allure of Darkness, all right, I'll take it. Look at the secret rare, first edition, Skull Arch Fiend of Lightning. That is absolutely gorgeous. And Allure of Darkness, secret rare. Man. All right, guys, I'll set those to the side. Let's check out the decks now. So that's pretty cool. And again, the guaranteed three Sacred Beast every time you open up one of these boxes as beautiful super rare cards. First little box here. Let's go through uh let's go through the extras. Usually they do the skill cards plus the extras here. Let's see how it goes. Nice. Ruthless means Supreme King. So it's not even Jaden, just Supreme King. Night Shroud. Camula. Freaking vampires and zombies guys will love it. Welcome to the jungle, Tanya with her uh, Amazonist. So now we have Amazonist Mai and Amazonist Tanya. That's crazy to think about. Archfiend's Conscription, dude, Archfiend deck from Titan. Professor of Alchemy, so Amnil. So the Professor turns into Amnil there. Unlocking Power, Kagemaru Fog Warning, Dark Unity, you Super Poly, oh man. That's Looks gross. Look at that. Nice. Zombie vampire life points. Gain life points when you click battle damage. Order of the Queen. Setting Sun. Victory of the Riders. Get out the different um, Sacred Beast. Dark Scorpion Gang. Is that Don's a Luke? <laughs> Bro, Don's a Luke. Let's go, man. So we actually have a Dark Scorpion deck here. So those must mean. Whoa, Ancient Rulers Rise. So this is Abidos. First and second sarcophagus there. Dark Creation. You, Bell. Yeah, I was going to say, they must give us Chick and Cliff. So I believe we have a full Dark Scorpion lineup combined with Yellow and GX now at this point. So that's pretty cool. So you have a full Dark Scorpion deck now. Good job there, Konami. Little Pharaohs people. Nice. Goga Giga Gaga Giga. Little Bite Line. Obsidian Dragon. Some Dark Worlds. Rainbow. Jiu Jitsu Master. Crazy card back in the day. Arch Fiends. Ill Blood. Because why not? Warwolf. Vampire Hunters. Aqua Spirits. Good card. Wind Spirit. Helios. Trice and Duo. And Cloudians. Flare Wingman. There he is. Arm Dragon Level 10. Cyber Dragon. Alternate Art. Allure of Darkness, Book of Moon, crazy, Chaos Trapel, Human Wave Tactics, and Nightmare Wheel and Zome. I believe those are like the two best cards in Speed Duel, so there you go. All right, so that was the extra cards. That kind of gave us some insight into what the different decks are going to have here. So let's check out the decks. Very cool box. All right, Evil Hero, Malicious Edge, Avian, Burstinitrix. So obviously we're getting into Supreme King with his Evil Heroes. Sparkman, Wild Heart, Infernal Gainer, Infernal Prodigy, Sand Moth, Versago. Wasn't that like Tournament Pack? Dark Roller Hodez, did he actually play that in the show? It's crazy. Absorbing Jar, Dark Fusion, Dark Calling, Evil Mind. Look at those reprints. Lightning, so look. They're saying you can put some Dark Worlds into a uh, little Evil Jaden's deck here. Evil Spring King. Super Poly Common. That's insane. Hero Signal, Dark Deal. Windstorm Ataqua. Wow. Malicious Fiend. Inferno Wing. Wild Cyclone. Man, to see these as commons is crazy. Dark Gaia. I think some of them might have been common. Lightning Golem. All right, so that's one deck right there. That's the Supreme King deck with Super Poly. That's kind of nuts to think about. We'll put that 
super poly on top as in that's probably the most valuable common in this whole thing all right red eyes darkness dragon so this is a, a red eyes deck that made its way into gx that again i hadn't watched all the way through so i didn't know that we had something like this it's pretty cool darkness dragon a red eyes black dragon a luster dragon luster dragon number two this is really cool to see dragon chick wyvern uh, black metal dragon or wyvern black metal dragon troop dragon nice troops Mirage Dragon, Spear Dragon, and Vanguard. Spear could be crazy in speed, but wow. Totem Dragon, Stamping Destruction again, Gunfire, Cosmic Cyclone, nice. Swing of Memories, Rage, Negate Attack, and a Red Eye Spirit. Two very good cards there. Wow. Just chilling. Whole little Red Eyes deck going on there. Let's see. Put Red Eyes in the front on that one. All right, going into it looks like some sort of Helios. Kind of deck going on over here. And again, with the bonus cards, we got some, some cards you can definitely add in. Like we talked about earlier. Golden Homunculus, Bazoo, Chaos Rider, Disc Blade. So what's this one? Banish Traps, Banish Spells, and Banish Monsters from the Grave. That's pretty cool, honestly, to see all three in a deck together, Konami. That's clever. Quite clever. DD Survivor. It gets Spanish, so this mac macro cosmos wombo combos there. Macro cosmos is actually good in the game today. Different dimension master banisher the radiance. So banisher the radiance will work with DD sick out playing the survivor as well. DD crow, of course, being in here. DD destroyer, grand mahu de Iza, maju de Iza, tribe shocking virus. Once per turn, banish monster from hand, destroy all face of monsters the same type. Well. That works well with Scout playing. I don't know about anything else, though. Still pretty cool to see in Speed Duels. Soul Release, guys. Soul Release. Galaxy Cyclone. Wow, Galaxy Cyclone. Grand Convergence. The gate. Different Dimension Encounter. That's pretty cool. Macrocosmos. Curse of Aging. All right. So that is the Macrocosmos deck. It's going to say a lot of good cards in here. DD Crow, Galaxy Cyclone. Put Macrocosmos on the top there for that deck. Wow. All right, it looks like we have our summoning, dark summoning deck for the Sacred Beast. I was going to say, they got to be careful with this deck. Deep Boys! <laughs> Deep Boys made its way into a deck. Let's go, baby. I remember pulling these back in the day. Good times, good times. Not played at all, but people try to put them in, you know, their god decks. So, Sacred Beast, I guess it makes sense for uh, Raviel. So, uh, Dark Summoning Beast is crazy for speed duels. Gravitic Orb. Cool. Goblin King. Didn't even think about that. That's pretty cool. Grave Protector. Shuffled into the deck instead. Huh. Fallen Paradise. Nice to see that. Some freaking starter deck card here. Cerulean Skyfire structure deck card. Veil of Darkness backup squad. Your opponent's card effect or their monster attack. Draw one for every thousand. The gate awakening a sacred beast and another uh, structure deck. Unending nightmare and speed duels. Aegis of Gaia, nice. 3,000 life points. Swamp mirror, final attack orders. Oh man, there's three decks in there. Honestly, I think dark summoning beast is the way. I'll put that one on the front. So we'll set this right here. All right, so it looks like we have a Cloudian deck, I'm guessing, because of those Cloudians, uh, Sheep Clouds we saw. So it's cool to see Fog King in here. Pretty cool. Neither player contribute cards. Powerful. And then the Cloudian deck. Atlas, Acid, Eye. Crazy to see all of these cards together. Konami, that's pretty cool. You know, like, I feel like Cloudians haven't gotten enough love. It's hard to make a deck out of the Vortex Trooper. Mother Grizzly as well. That's pretty cool to see. Vortex Trooper, too. Cloudian cards here. Squall, Cloud, Aerosol, Diamond Dust, Fog Control, Raging, Rain, and Wall of Disruption. Interesting. I guess there's some water going on there. <laughs> Trichel Tribute, maybe. Um, but it's cool to see these Cloudian cards here. All in one little deck. Uh, even though he's not really a cloudy, and I guess we'll leave Fog King on the top for that 
kind of crazy card that was in there. And it looks like we have at least three more decks here still. Crazy. Can I really package this into one little, blo little box? All right, what else do we got? Vampires, guys. Crazy. Vampires. I love vampires. I am so happy to see this as a deck, guys. I am to the moon. To the moon. Vampire Genesis. You know if Vampire Genesis is in here, Vampire Lord's going to be in here as a common. Vampire Baby. Vampire Familiar. Vampire Lady. Vampire Lord. Vampire Retainer. Guys, this is awesome. Vampire Sorcerer is in here as a common. Vampire Curse. Zombina and Goblin Zombie and Plague Wolf. Even Heavy Knight of the Flame. And Ryu Kaki. We got the Kaki in here as well. Man, what vampire cards are they missing? I feel like they gave us a couple in those extra cards. Let's look at those extra cards one more time here. Arm Dragon. Vampire Koala. Is that it? Man, I feel like... Oh, Vampire Hunter. Okay, we got a couple. They gave us a couple here. Still really cool to see all this madness. Truly some madness here. So, back in the day... I really tried to make a vampire deck, even though we all knew it wasn't good when Dasset came out. Uh, Dark Saviors. Um, it was a good time, though. It was a good time. Definitely won some games and lost a lot of games as well. All right, Call the Mummy is here. Book of Life. Crazy right now. This is pretty crazy. Foolish Burial, Soul Exchange, Vampire Desire, Checkpoint, and Awakening. What? That's crazy, man. Crazy. I love this. Love this. Technically, kind of a Kaiba deck as well, right? Kaiba is known for playing some vampire cards like Vampire Lord. Um, but definitely a Camellia deck with her vampires because she's literally like a vampire. All right, Amazonus. Now, Amazonus has always been one of the most popular speed duel decks, and to see it in here is pretty fantastic. And it's got updated cards. So we got Queen, Swordswoman, Tiger, Paladin, Chainmaster, Fighter, Trainee, Sage, Scouts, Battle Survivor. I always read this card and I always liked him actually. Been a battle phase, add one card from your grave. I was sent there during a battle phase. So pretty good card there. But I uh, would have liked to see another Amazon. But to see so many different Amazonist cards is very cool. And we already had some from Mize cards. But now we have another player. Reinforcements, Amazonist Heirloom, and Village is commons. Crazy. Fighting Spirit made its way in here. Spellcaster. Archers is awesome. Willpower. Rescue. Pawn. Half Counter. Crazy. Crazy. Like, that's, to me, that's pretty exciting, guys. That's pretty exciting to see another Amazonist deck, and this time updated. Now, we're going back. We're going back to the day, guys. Back to the days of Dark Crisis here. I actually tried to play this deck many many moons guys it worked sometimes sometimes it didn't you really needed falling down but i doubt they put that in speed duels but here it is guys the arch fiend deck they actually made this deck for speed duels that is so exciting to me um honestly i just i love that they did this uh but yeah so in here we're gonna see our cards see what's going on but shout out to dark crisis i mean we got vampires from dark crisis we got freaking arch fiends from back in the day Let's see what's going on here. So they decided not to put Summon Skull. I really thought, I really thought, Konami, you would have put Summon Skull in here as a extra card, normal, and a secret. And it would have been a secret. That would have been crazy because Speed Duels doesn't have Summon Skull. I really thought we were going to get Summon Skull like that. But they gave us Skull Archfiend of Lightning. I still feel like Summon Skull could have made, made its way in here. I would have loved to have... A secret rare summon skull, just easy to grab first edition. Boom. All right, we got Skull Archfiend of Lightning. He does come as a secret rare as well. We got Archfiend Soldier. Man, the speed duel cards are getting crazy. Terror King, these are four star 19, 2000. We got Infernal Queen. Man, to see these all in one deck is nuts. We got Infernal Queen, Vile Pond, Shadow Knight. Dude, guys, it's the whole Dark Crisis lineup. The Dark Bishop, Des Crook, Des Rook. And Giant Orc from MFC. Missed Archfiend, what, AST? And Annihilator Archfiend from some newer sets. Archfiend General, a couple newer sets there, guys. Like, what? What? Man, if Archfiend General's in here, you all know it's going to be in here right now. This is going to be Pandemonium! It's Pandemonium up in here, guys. 
Straight pandemonium. If I put that in the title, people probably won't know what's going on but of this video, but I really want to now. It's pandemonium. It's chaos. Love it. Another foolish burial. Checkmate. Axe of despair. Oh my God. Double spell. Archfiend's roar. Battle scarred and dark ruler no more. I really would have thought the dark ruler card would have been one of these decks, but you know what? We'll take it. Guys, what a phenomenal lineup. This is fantastic. This is truly what I would expect of a speed build product. They made sure to put cards in here that are relevant to the meta too. So there's some good value cards as well. The secrets are awesome. Honestly, guys, this could have been much better. I feel like the one thing I've brought up a couple times, maybe, maybe could have made it better. But I mean, this is pretty fantastic, Konami. I really do like this product. Um, skull, yeah, like I said, a summon skull in here would have been great. But still, to see all these beautiful cards, guys, eight different decks, fantastic secrets, fantastic reprints. Um, Allure of Darkness, Super Poly, Macro Cosmos is in here. I mean, these are all cards that have been $5 commons in the past. You know, maybe we'll see them as dollar to $5 commons in here as well. So we'll see how it all goes, guys. But as always, thank you so much for watching. Remember to enter that giveaway. We're giving away again three separate sealed decks of this. You guys are going to get the whole shebang here. All you guys need to do is like this video and post it in the comments below. You know, what is your favorite deck? What, is, what duelist is your favorite duelist or what deck is your favorite deck from this box? Let us know in the comments below what you're thinking. Make sure you subscribe. All right, you guys, shout out to simplyunlucky.com and the 25th anniversary, guys. It's coming out 420. It's going to be nuts. It's going to be absolute nuts. Shenanigans, reprints across the board for the first few sets. I have the packs here. Let's look at it. So we have LOB, MRD, Invasion of Chaos, Pharaoh's Servant, Spell Roller, Dark Crisis, guys. These packs are all coming to you in the 25th anniversary, coming out very soon, 420. It's going to be nuts, guys. Absolute shenanigans. Um, definitely get your pre-orders in on simplyelectric.com if you have not already. We do have some left, but they are flying. They are truly flying. And the booster boxes do come out in, I believe, July. Um, but right now, 420, get them early, get your packs. Remember, Dark Crisis can only come from the Legendary Collection 25th Anniversary, which is coming out 420. Does not have a booster box later. So, guys, check it out. Link at the top of the description below. Let's pop these packs open. I mean, shout out to Dark Crisis right now, guys. Holy guacamole. Dark Crisis is getting so much love in this Speed Duel box. Let's see what we get. Here we go. Like, literally, already at the top, there was a Shadow Knight. Arsenal Robber. Blinding Loyal Goblin. Sasuke Samurai. Falling down. So there's the falling down card I was talking about earlier. That is literally Snatch Steel for Archfiend cards, Archfiend decks. So it says there, destroy this card. There's no Archfiend card on your side of the field. Take control of the opponent's monster. Take 800 damage. Woo! Snatch Steel if you have for an Archfiend deck. Too bad. Shadow Knight, Archfiend. Nice. Checkmate. We just saw that. Ojama Trio, Maju, and Archfiend Soldier. Shout out to the soldier that is in our Archfiend deck right there. Beautiful. Any other packs in here getting some love from this set? I feel like MFC is, but that's not here right now. Let's just jump into Invasion Chaos. I feel like Pandemonium, Chaos, one of my favorite sets here. We stumbling right now. We stumbling. Again, guys, shout out. Link at the top of the description below. 25th anniversary cards coming soon. Salvage, Skullmark, Ladybug, Earth Chance, Spatial Collapse, Stumbling, Dez Crook, Pinch Hopper, and Trap Jammer. You know what? We'll take a foil. Fuma Shuriken there. Little trap jammer going on there, stopping those traps. Uh, let's do Metal Raiders. Let's do Metal Raiders next. Love these classic packs, guys. So beautiful. So amazing. Mystic Lamp. All right, all right. What are we getting? What are we getting? Gazelle, Roaring Snake, Ring, Mushroom Man, Punished Eagle, and Horn of Heaven Ultra Rare. That's two foils. That's two foils. From just six packs here. That's pretty good. And Sanjan. <laughs> good card there. Wow, guys. Pretty good. Pretty good. Two traps. Two beautiful foils. Horn of Heaven is actually pretty hard to get. So we got Horn of Heaven. We got Trap Jammer. Can we get three? You enter the God Realm at four foils. That's almost impossible. So let's knock on the door with three foils. Let's do it, guys. Pharaoh's Servant. I feel like we might pull Jizno today. Here we go. Can we get some tunes? Can we get some tunes? Come on, baby. Octoburser, Weather Report, Dark Zebra, Gaia Power, nice. Mystic Plasma Zone, beautiful cards there. Stone Ogre, Red Archery Girl, almost a, a tune. And Mother Grizzly, shout out to Mother Grizzly. She was in this deck in the Cloudian. She was in the Cloudian deck over there. Nice to see her. Pharaoh's Servant, guys, you ready? Can we get three foils? Can we knock on the God Realm? Can we knock on the door? 
Come on, baby. Thousand Eyes Idol. Nice card there. Three-headed Guido. Gamble. We're gambling. Dark Bat. I, Cyber Falcon. What? Ultra Rare. Thousand Eyes Restrict. My man. What an incredible pull. Wow. Got the gold, man. Wow, the monster on the pack. One of Pegasus's big monster cards. Thousand Eyes Restrict. What? Three foils? Three foils out of six packs? I feel like we opened these six packs at the end of a couple videos and pulled nothing. All right, this is crazy. This is crazy. We got Thousand Eyes, Horn of Heaven, Trap Jammer. Guys, we're on a roll. We're knocking on the door. Are they going to let us in? Are we going to see a godly video today? Legend of Blue Eyes White Dragon. Can we get four foils out of just six packs? Here we go. Sea King, Dark Energy, Fiend Reflection, Violent Crystal, Larvis, Petite, Scarred, Reaper of the Cards. <laughs> We're knocking on the door. Just knocking on the door. Appreciate you guys. Thanks for watching. Remember to check out the link at the top of the description below.